All right, today I'm going to show you how to create a ringtone from one of the songs in your iTunes. And the reason why I'm doing this is because um, I went on YouTube and either the people's videos had a lot of music in the background or they were just typing everything or they were just doing it way too fast. So I'm going to go at a slower pace so you can do it along with me. And um, so here we go. So first you want to make sure your iTunes is open and that your iPhone is connected to your computer. After you do that, um, under music in library, you want to choose the song that you want to be your ringtone. I'm going to choose creator, so I'm going to right click on that and choose get info. Now under get info, you're going to see a bunch of these tabs and what you want to choose is options. Okay, under options, um, there's a start time and stop time over here. And I think the most it allows you to do is 30 seconds. So if you want to, you can pause it, listen to the song and choose what part you want it to be. So mine starts at 52 seconds and it ends at so minute 18, I think. I think that's 26 seconds, so it's fine. And that's the part of the song I like. So press OK. Okay, you can see Creator is still highlighted. So you want to right click on that again and choose Create Double AC Version. So this is going to create a copy. With this copy is going to be your ringtone. So wait, converting. All right. <coughs> Almost there. It usually shouldn't take this long. My computer is just very slow. Come on. There we go. <clears throat> okay, now I highlight the copied version, so mine was 26 seconds. Okay, so right click on that and choose um, Show in Windows Explorer. Alright, so here is your song right there. Now this is the really important part. You can see it's M4A. In order to make the ringtone, you want to ch change the A to an R. You have to do that or else it's not going to work. Alright, so change it. It's going to give this rename box. That's okay. Alright, now click on uh, your song and then drag it all the way to your library. Once you did that, you can just close this. Alright, so let's go to the left under ringtones, and there it is. That's the song. Let's make sure it works. Alright. Now I'll show you how to actually put it into your iPhone and make sure it's in there. Alright, so over here on the left under devices, click on your iPhone. This is why your iPhone has to be connected. Okay. So, up here you want to choose ringtones, and you can either have all ringtones or selected. Mine, right now I just have one. I accidentally deleted all mine. Alright, so I'll check mark the creator, and then down here you're going to see apply. You want to click on apply. Now your iPhone should say sync in progress. I think it's it's copying all my songs. It's okay, whatever. Bear with me. Also, um, I'm going to write what I did step by step in the description, just in case you didn't understand what I said. Alright, so sync is done. Now what we want to do is make sure it is in our iPhone. Okay, 
Now what you want to do is slide to unlock, choose settings, choose sounds, choose ringtone, and under custom you're going to see your song, and mine is right there, the creator. So now what you want to do is let's go to contacts. And then just pick a contact that you want. Um, let's see, I already know who I want this for. Alright, so pick your contact, choose edit, and the last part is you choose ringtone, and it's under there under custom. When you choose that, when you choose that, just press save and that's it. If you have any questions, just leave a comment and I'll try to figure it out for you if it's not working. But that's that. Thanks for watching. Bye.